Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you for joining me for today's yoga practice. We're going to begin coming onto our hands and knees, getting straight into it here. Knees are hip width apart. Um, our hands are shoulder width apart, wrists in line with our shoulders, and our knee is in line with our hips. We're going to start here just taking a few hip circles. So just moving the hips forward as we inhale and as we exhale, taking them back and around. Continuing with our breath and taking it over to the other side when you're ready. Seeing if we can wriggle out some of that anxious energy, come back to our breath. And coming to find stillness here, we're going to walk our fingertips forward and bring our chest towards the floor. Hips are staying up high. And towards the ceiling, grounding our forehead to the floor. Continuing to breathe here, feeling that opening in our chest. And then slowly bring the fingertips back. Moving into cat cow. As we inhale, we're dropping the belly, taking the gaze forward up to the ceiling. And as we exhale, rounding through the back, taking the gaze through the legs. Inhale. Exhaling. Inhaling. Pulling that chest forward. Exhaling, rounding through the back, tucking the chin. One more round here, inhaling and exhale. And coming to flat back, we're going to inhale, lifting our right arm, our left arm, sorry, up towards the ceiling, and exhale back down. Inhaling up, exhaling down. Continuing here with your breath. Opening up through our heart space here. Coming to find stillness. And when you're ready, moving over to the other side. Inhale, lifting that right arm up and down. Inhaling up, exhaling down. Inhaling up, exhaling back down. Two more at your own pace. Awesome work. Coming back to sit on our heels here. Very often when we're just feeling low energy and we're not feeling like ourselves and we're just in a bit of a bad mood, it will show in our body. So even just starting to slouch over and, you know, our heads are down. So this practice is really about bringing our focus back up, opening up this heart space here, relaxing down our shoulders, even when we tend to feel a bit stressed, uh, we're just straight away showing our shoulders starting to tense up towards our ears. So we're really working within this practice to ground back into our breath and with each exhale allowing our body to soften and open. So sitting back on our heels here, 
taking our hands behind the back, interlacing them, and pulling the hands down the spine towards the floor. As we inhale, rolling the shoulders open, softening them down, and just taking the gaze either in front of you or lifting the gaze up towards the ceiling. Finding length in the spine, sitting up nice and tall. Check in with your breath. And taking that arms back out. And just bringing them up now into cactus arms. So bringing them in front of our face, palms coming to touch. So as we inhale, we're opening the arms here and pulling the chest forward. And as we exhale, closing the gap, palms together, rounding through the back. Inhale, forward. Exhale. Arms are strong here, inhaling. Pulling that heart forward on the inhale. Rounding through the back, exhale. Inhaling. Exhaling. One more round here. Awesome work, guys. Coming back onto hands and knees. We're going to inhale our right arm up and moving into thread the needle here. So it's gliding behind that left hand now, out to the side, shoulder comes down and just resting there on the side right cheek. That left arm's either just here near your face or perhaps walking the fingertips towards the front of the mat. The hips are up high towards the ceiling. Really encouraging this opening of the chest here, of the upper back. Maybe even closing down the eyes. Softening that right shoulder. Gently walking the left hand back to lift you up. Coming back to tabletop. Let's go over to the other side. Inhale, left arm up. Thread that behind the right hand. Resting now on the opposite cheek. Softening out the shoulders. After your next exhale, slowly coming to lift. Moving now into a low lunge, let's lift that right foot to the outside of your right hand. So it's not going in between your hands, it's going to the outside of the right hand. Really creating space here for you to move. And then we're going to just stay here for a few rounds of breath. Really feeling that stretch here in the hips opening up. And let's inhale, stay where we are, but inhale, lifting that right arm up towards the ceiling. Maybe even taking that right foot to the blade edge of your foot, creating space here. Nice, active and strong. Exhale, back down. Let's bring that foot back. And this time taking our left foot to the front. So we're taking our left foot to the edge of our mat, just next to our left hand. Finding our foundation here, we're feeling nice and strong. And we're not collapsing here at the chest. Our arms are active and strong, holding us up. 
as we inhale, send that breath deep into the belly and the hips and exhale out. Breathing into the belly, exhale, releasing any tension feeling in the hips. You've got this guys, let's plant that right hand. As we inhale, lift that left arm up towards the ceiling. There's a nice active pose here. Opening up all parts of our body, creating space, allowing any energy that we're not using to flow out. Exhale back down. Let's bring that foot back. Bring the big toes together, take the knees out wide. And move back into child's pose. Hips are moving back towards the heels. Walking the fingertips forward, either making a fist a pillow with your hands for your forehead to rest on or just allowing your forehead to rest onto the ground. Allowing yourself to come back to your breath. Noticing how you're feeling from when you started this practice. Maybe you didn't feel like getting on your mat but you did it anyway. Noticing how you're feeling now. Slowly coming to sit up. I'm just coming into a comfortable seated position now. Up sitting on a pillow or a bolster, lifting those hips up. Softening the shoulders down away from the ears, pulling that chest forward, sitting up just a little bit taller. And we're just going to take our hands to cross towards our shoulders and our neck. And then we're closing down the eyes, just applying a bit of pressure and giving yourself a little massage from the neck towards your shoulders. I know sometimes when I'm feeling stressed or a bit tense, we're just having like an off day. Getting a massage just feels so nourishing and soothing. Sometimes we forget we can just do self-massage. Connecting back to our body. Maybe even taking a massage down the arms. And then when you're done, just bringing the hands to rest on the thighs. Taking a big breath in. Soften the shoulders down, exhaling out. Breathing in through the nose, allowing the air to travel down to your belly. Open your mouth and exhale out, feeling everything soften. Breathing in through the nose, out through the mouth. One more round of breath, inhaling. Big exhale. Bringing the hands to a prayer in front of the heart space. Thanking yourself for showing up today for you, for practicing yoga today, for giving yourself this moment of self care. And I also thank you for joining me on your mat today. See you next week.